Welcome to this Excel tutorial where we'll tackle the task of averaging absolute values. In this video, we'll explore two methods to calculate the average of absolute values in Excel. One method involves using a helper column, while the other utilizes a formula for a more streamlined approach. Let's dive in and enhance your data analysis skills. Let's start with the first method in this tutorial. We'll show you how to calculate the average of absolute values in Excel using a helper column. This approach provides clarity and control by temporarily storing absolute values. Let's dive in and see how it's done. Ensure you have your Excel worksheet ready, containing the data you want to analyze. Insert a new column adjacent to your data where you'll calculate the absolute values. In the first cell of the helper column, use a formula like equals ABS, A2, assuming your data starts in cell A2. This calculates the absolute value of the corresponding data point. Copy this formula down to apply it to all data points. In a cell below the helper column, use the formula equals average, V2, V8. This calculates the average of the absolute values. Adjust the formulas and cell references according to the location of your data. Now, let's explore the second method in this tutorial. We'll demonstrate how to calculate the average of absolute values in Excel using a formula. This method offers a streamlined approach for quick and efficient analysis. Let's get started and uncover this formula-based technique. Ensure you have your Excel worksheet open, containing the data you want to analyze. In a cell where you want to display the average, use the formula equals average ABS, A2, A8, where A2, A8 is the range of data you want to calculate the average of absolute values for. Adjust the formula and cell references to match your data range. There you have it. Two methods to calculate the average of absolute values in Excel. Whether you prefer the clarity of a helper column or the simplicity of a formula, you now have the tools to analyze your data effectively. Thanks for watching.